Mpenzi mtazamaji kama ndio kwanza nafungua channel yako ya TF TV tafadhali subscribe ili uwe mwanzo kupata video zetu mbali mbali za ndani na nje ya nchi. Share video hii bila kusahau kudondosha komenti yako kwani ni muhimu sana. Thank you very much. Thank you Canada, the government, the people for the support that uh, you have been extending to Tanzania in many sectors, uh, be it health, education, in the area of defense and security, uh, trade and investment. Uh, actually, it looks like the numbers are saying uh, since uh, the 60s, we have benefited to the tune of $3.4 billion. Uh, and this is, uh, this is a lot, and we highly value that. Um, but we have continued to support each other at the United Nations and the Commonwealth Framework uh, in terms of uh, pursuit of SDGs. Uh, but also we have been receiving support uh, on the burden we have been carrying for the international community uh, to keep a large number of uh, refugees, uh, conflict, um, prevention um, in Africa in our endeavor to uh, maintain global peace which is critical to all of us and especially now uh, when we see turmoil everywhere around the, around the world. Under the President Samia's administration we have focused very much on uh, continually opening up uh, this economy. So we have embarked on very serious reforms, uh, institutional, uh, fiscal, on the taxation front, um, engendering democratic governance. Uh, and therefore, uh, Tanzania is a much better place to invest. And uh, we have tried to establish a number of industrial parks and export processing zones. Uh, we are still struggling at, at our very early stages of developing our blue economy. And these are some of the areas where we think um, our great friends, Canada, could, uh, could help us. We have uh, invested a lot in terms of developing our health care, uh, but we definitely need uh, uh, more in terms of uh, investment in pharmaceutical industry. You are also aware that we moved to Dodoma officially, yes, yes. our new seat, uh, capital city in, the, in central Tanzania, and there are also opportunities there for, uh, for investment, again in a wide range of areas including infrastructure, Solid waste management is a new area. Uh, again, pharmaceuticals, manufacturing industries, and even in the area of sports, uh, we would really enjoy to have a, a modern sports arena uh, in Dodoma. Uh, maybe two more. Uh, horticulture uh, seems to be very uh, upcoming. Uh, um, I think we need to work together to um, expedite uh, negotiations and eventually signing of the uh, Foreign Investment Promotion and Protection Agreement, FIPA. I think this is uh, key. Um, and then uh, you, you, are, you are aware that uh, this week, uh, Her Excellency the President did chair, co-chair a summit of the global leaders. Uh, she has made a decision to champion uh, clean cooking uh, and therefore, and we are happy that Canada uh, indeed did sign the outcome of the summit, so we are, we are delighted and, and we do hope that uh, uh, Canada will remain at the forefront of supporting us uh, in this initiative because for us it is key. Uh, you cannot continue telling our people stop using uh, cutting down trees for cooking, but what is the alternative? So we need to move to um, uh, clean cooking uh, energy. And um, we have set ourselves a national target that at least by 2034, 
80% uh, of the Tanzanian population should be using uh, clean energy uh, for, for cooking. I just want to begin by, uh, first of all, expressing on behalf of the Government of Canada our deepest sympathies uh, for the families that have been impacted by uh, Storm Hidaya and the El Nino effect and the deaths, injuries, displacement and damage that, that uh, Hidaya has caused and we stand in solidarity with you. Uh, and uh, we understand and we are there with you to address to address and mitigate against the, these negative impacts of climate change that are affecting all of us, uh, including the, the, the Republic of Tanzania. So in that regard, Canada understands that the solutions to, to, to tackle this common challenge will require us to work together and to address it globally, not just within one country. And in that regard, we are uh, obviously taking our responsibility. And uh, Canada is, I'm happy to share with you that Canada is investing in climate action right here in Tanzania. And we recently announced $15 million for two projects. And those projects are focusing on strengthening the livelihoods of coastal regions. Um, and these are, for example, protecting uh, vital mangroves and regenerating uh, seascapes, the sea atmosphere. So uh, the sea environment, I should say. So, so it's about livelihoods, it's about protecting the environment, it's about community resilience against future events. At the end of the day, the way I see this relationship is strong relationship, very deep and historical, all weather friend, consistent, who has been there with you in your development journey. Now that you have emerged as a, a up middle to upper middle income country, now we want to do more. We want to do trade, we want to do investment, we want to do joint ventures, uh, but you know, we want you to just send that signal to those Canadian businesses who are looking for that. Uh, for that. Um, my very important, my last stop today in my visit to Tanzania uh, will, will it'll, it's the last but it's not the least because I will be announcing uh, I'll be visiting project partners who are doing really good work in Tanzania and I will announce an additional 25 million dollar commitment to a Sally Africa Agri SME market incentive facility. So this, this will help Agro businesses. Uh, it will uh, invest in training. It will invest in training session for lenders. Uh, we will have conversations about the lending partners in Tanzania, uh, the, the Tanzania Commercial Bank, and uh, it's about de-risking uh, in, in investment uh, for lenders so that they can put more money in in agro businesses. It also is about providing technical assistance. Tiff TV na kupatia video mbali mbali kutoka ndani na nje ya nchi. Tafadhali endelea kutufuatilia kupitia channel yetu ya Tiff TV, YouTube, Facebook, Twitter na Instagram. Bila kusahau kudondosha comment yako kwani ni muhimu sana. Tiff TV tupo kijamii